OK, some breaking news to bring you, and it comes from Syria. And Massimiliano Allegri has been confirmed as the Juventus coach once again. He had a very, very successful spell at the club between 2014 and 2019, winning the Serie A five times back-to-back uh, -back as well. Of course, they didn't get on so well this season under Andrea Pirlo, uh, finishing fourth, <coughs> Excuse me, which uh, was a massive... Uh, well, shock given their recent uh, form, wasn't it? So they've brought Massimiliano Allegri back into the club. Let me just uh, bring you the statement from the uh, club. It says Allegri finds a bench he knows uh, very well, a club he loves and loves him to start a new journey together today towards new goals. Those achieved in his first adventure with Juventus, which I've just talked about, are engraved in the history of the club. Five Scudetti, four consecutive double Goals with the Italian Cup, two Super Cups, two Champions League finals in three seasons, epic feats in Italy and in Europe. We said goodbye two years ago with a message, uh, history alone, delivered by our president to the coach, a hug and a shirt on which, in two words, all Allegri's experience at Juve was, they say. The beauty of the story, however, is that it never stops. And in football, this means a concept that we have ingrained in our DNA, the best victory is the next always. It's quite an epic statement, isn't it? And then we are ready to restart with Allegri, they say, to build our future together with his enormous professionalism, his moral strength, with the brilliant ideas of a technician capable of clearing the cards on and off the pitch, with his smile, a sort of signature, with his way of understanding football and life, simplicity, desire to play down, commitment to enjoy every beautiful moment that living at Juventus can give and will give. I think that has set the tone for managerial statements uh, from uh, the rest of the clubs this summer from Juventus there. Massimiliano Allegri is back.